So uh, I'm back out here at the Hermitage. This is, let's see, one, two, three, four, maybe my fifth visit out here. And uh, four or five, I can't quite remember off the top of my head. So um, I, I, this day was supposed to start three, four hours ago. Uh, being out here but unfortunately some family obligations required me to uh, do some other things prior to coming here so we're looking at now it's a nice uh, quiet evening and it is five, coming up to quarter to six so I got maybe 45 minutes of work here before I have to um, move on and I got enough contraption enough material here to uh, to uh, choke a horse. So um, today the goal is just really to work on the brickwork, um, create the base color. Um, that's really with the amount of time I have left for now. That's really all I'm going to be able to do. If I get to cover the uh, the face of the brickwork, uh, um, then I'll be good, and then we'll head out of here, and then uh, I'll try to get out of here. Uh, another time and from here on out uh, my schedule is going gets really crazy uh, I've got lots of family commitments and uh, I got some shows coming up in the fall that I need to prepare with so it's really difficult to know when I'm gonna get out here meanwhile the whole mansions under threat um, it's the decision to um, to on the future it's been deferred for my understanding for about three months or Ferguson the council for this area put in uh, our city council to not make a decision to he explore some other options on saving the the, uh, the ruins and good going for uh, <laughs> let me get my thumbs up here good going Lloyd uh, that's a great job I I wasn't sure where he would come down on this issue but um, he looks like he's ready to make a fight of it and that's a, that's good news there's uh, some young ladies who have created a Facebook page and they're doing a fantastic job they're doing the job that we couldn't do me and uh, Rob were trying to lobby the permits committee and then heritage committee um, and they were able to get a Facebook page going with uh, there I think they're up to 400 450 uh, uh, members on the page and that's excellent that's a great job for, uh, great job on their part um, they're in the the the, the um, uh, the, the ward, I want to say riding, but it's not riding. They're in the area, so Lori Ferguson is their counselor, and that's good, so that carries more weight. Uh, you have uh, the citizens of Ancaster voicing their concerns, um, and that is excellent. Uh, they're doing a fantastic job. There's a lot of new material coming out that I've never seen before on uh, the Hermitage uh, and its history, and that is a fantastic thing. Uh, and, and at the very least, there's a lot of information coming out that I didn't know about. So it's becoming quite a educational opportunity, their Facebook page. And please, if you haven't already, please uh, 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 join up to that page, stay in touch, write uh, the counselors, let, you, let them know that this, uh, this great uh, historical designated uh, uh, building needs to be desert, uh, preserved and yeah it's great so I'm working uh, but that this is this is about uh, art and this so what I'm doing today is just trying to block in some more of the colors on the canvas uh, and then I'll have to come back and then start the, the future visits will be then refining 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 to I get to the point where I feel it's a, a well-developed painting sketch and that's what this is it's not a full-fledged painting it's a painting sketch and so so that's what I'm aiming for. So thanks very much. I'm going to keep this really short and um, and uh, take advantage of the let's see now the 40 minutes or so I have left here. Okay, take care. Bye.
so it's been it's only been about an hour or so of work on the canvas um sorry I let me step over this way it's only been less than an hour uh, of work, uh, just over an hour of work on the canvas. Haven't really got a lot. I, I was able to block in the colors, the base color, really roughly. I had a couple directions ago, yellow base, red base, blue base. Um, I went for kind of a, um, a yellow brown, orca, um, yellow orca color. Uh, as sort of a, a base color that I'll work on over time. It's um, this kind of stage, it kind of always feels kind of hopeless. It doesn't feel like it will ever mount in anything. Um, I always find this as sort of a rough patch. But nevertheless, I got, the, I got it blocked in. So now all the uh, portions of the painting are covered with paint and now I can start refining, building building up the the composition to to uh to the point where i feel that i've reached as far as i want to go um it's very peaceful out here it's very quiet uh very nice uh, uh i came here a little bit more uh, rushed and and haggard because uh, i had a number of family obligations uh underway uh today and um so um in that so i wasn't quite le quite in the, the best mind space for something like this and especially when you feel rushed and under the gun like it's it's a, it's a past six o'clock the sun setting it's getting kind of a, a, a mellow colors and not the best like usually very strong strong contrast of colors so anyhow uh, finish that and we have people coming in and take care bye hey guys Hello, sir. How's it going? Not too bad. Very nice. Yeah, Thank very you. Nice. Did not do that.